You are watching a simulation, but it could well be a real emergency situation in which an injured person is being rescued. The servicemen at the Cerro Muriano military base in Cordoba are training with SNAID, a new extraction device created in Cordoba which facilitates the rescue and minimizes the time taken to complete the process. Nuestro tiempo mínimo de empleo han sido 90 segundos. Normalmente con los procedimientos anteriores tardamos 6-7 minutos en evacuar una una baja. According to the World Health Organization, between 250,000 and 500,000 people suffer spinal cord injuries each year. In a rescue with conventional extraction tools, the risk of damaging the patient further, taking more time or causing infection are the main difficulties. Antiguamente lo que se utilizaba era el collarín estándar y luego se utilizaba lo que se denominaba una boa, que en realidad era una manta reliada o una sábana, se, lo, se utilizaba cualquier recurso. Inside, it contains a chemical formula, which upon contacting bones, hardens and immobilizes the injured, making a cervical block which avoids putting pressure on the airways. Its handles of 2.7 meters grip the patient from under the arms, enabling their extraction. Presenta una doble función, la función de inmovilización y la función de extracción. Puede ser aplicado en personas de diferente complexión y diferente tamaño del cuello. Puede ser aplicado de una forma rápida in cualquier tipo de entorno. SNAID is patented in 199 countries. Until now, the device had been developed for the medical industry and army, and it's also being developed to adapt it to a marine environment.